are live. Hi, Josh. We are live. Live. You sure are alive. We're live. We're live. It's the Stern family. <laughs> you sure are alive. Alive. We're so, we're here. Alive. We are alive, and we are alive. <laughs> what day is today? Friday. Friday. Happy Friday. Friday. Happy Friday, everybody. Happy, Happy spring. Oh, yes. 26. Happy spring. It's been a long winter, right? It's been a long winter. Sun is shining. It's crazy. Somebody said they got their signed CD in the mail. Awesome. Hi, Raquel. It's Raquel. That's my aunt's name. Yay. South Carolina, what's up? I'm just saying hi to everybody. Wolfpack Shadow 3, that's a cool name. Wolfpack Shadow 3. Wolfpack. The Wolfpack. One man Wolfpack. Wolfpack. <laughs> All right. Hey, Lacey from Tennessee, what's up, Metalhead? We're just saying hello. Fly the Fist, still one of my favorite bands, too. Charles Osborne. Hi, everybody. I just wanted to tell you guys something. Today, I wanted to sign on and say hello. Edge Fest being in Dallas. Um, that is not a complete sentence. I don't really know what you're trying to say. <laughs> Edge Fest, hey. Edge Fest being in Dallas. Uh, <laughs> Sorry, I'm come up with something you. clever. Chris, on that. Okay. So, we need to go back to Arkansas. Look at him. Like, you know. Have we been to Arkansas? Hey, from Oklahoma. Guess what? Oh, jeez. <laughs> Oklahoma is paying Please people to move mention. to Tulsa. Right by the Cherokee Nation. Uh, if you have any interest in living in Oklahoma and Tulsa, apparently they'll pay you $10,000 or fifteen grand to move there. Uh, they're looking it up and trying to decide if that's what, something we want to do. It's a little more south than Pennsylvania. And, uh, Oklahoma? Thinking. I think Oklahoma's like... <laughs> it's kind of a close. south. <laughs> it's totally south. Wait, is it? Yes, it's uh, south. Have you ever heard a person from Oklahoma? My, my geography could be off, but I think it's all right. It's only a slight down. Hey, from Ohio, you're over. They're over. <laughs> over. Ohio's over. They're, They're also paying to, to move to Ohio. No, no, all right. No, no, no. Oh, I think I'm no. I'm missing my favorite people. I can't. Oh, what's up, everybody? I see Kristen on here. All right. So what I wanted to say is. Josh and I finally agreed. On? On what? <laughs> awesome. Should we talk about this? <laughs> on some merchandise. Oh. oh wait, what did we agree on? <laughs> like, moving to Tulsa? <laughs> uh, announcement. I'm just saying this online live so that he doesn't yell at me when I say I'm moving to Tulsa. We're, we're moving to Tulsa. I applied. They have I'm accepted. They're giving us 15 grand. No, just kidding. Um, oh yeah, we created some new merch, which a lot of you guys have already got. There's Atticus in the back. Yeah, some of you have already gotten some merch. If you're not on the mailing list, There's sign my up. Son. His mailing list found out first. Woohoo! Mailing list found out first about the merch, because that's what the mailing list is for. To find out first. I'm sorry that I don't have, if you're on, listen, if you're on the mailing list, Lacey's very adamant about them being like personal messages <laughs> and having, you know, not just like commercials. Yeah. Hey, it's us again. Got something to sell. We don't want to do that. But I don't feel like I'm very personal with emails. No. And I don't know that people want to have a bunch of whole emails of, you know, what you guys doing. Felt cute. It might delete later. I don't know. <laughs> so I'm sorry if I'm not very. Um, to the you're more to the point. I'm more direct always. To the point. If Lacey wrote the email, I talk too much. it'd be like a book, which yeah. you guys would probably love. I did so write maybe, a book, two maybe, books, three maybe books. Maybe I'll get her to write the emails. No. No, because I'm probably doing something else, like lecturing my children um, while they're trying to get me to shut up. <laughs> <laughs> I probably should not write the emails, but Josh is writing them, so... That's why some of you knew, and that's the only reason, because I am running around doing a million things. Like right now, we're on our way somewhere. Where are we going? Home. We're going home. We're at Ace Hardware, getting something. Traeger Pellet.
grill. Does anybody out there have a Traeger grill? It's a grill. It's amazing. It's a smoker. Somebody gave it to us as a present. That was awesome. And Merry Christmas to I learned Josh. how to cook. Instant cook. And I am so happy when he cooks. It's delicious. I love Lego. It's, uh, yeah, he's a good cook. Okay. We're not talking about anything. Except... What's the point of this? Is to talk about nothing. Arrow wants to show his Lego. Arrow wants to show us. Oh, Arrow built this. He designed this himself. If you want the instructions... You won't be able to find them. Just take a snapshot. You can only to... you can only be inspired by this creation. Yeah. Atticus is on his sweet new overalls. Atticus is on some John, John Deere John Deere overalls. I yes. Overalls. I got all my kids overalls for the summer because they're gonna wear them every day, and I'm, I'm not gonna worry about their clothes. And I even got my own. Woohoo! I'm gonna wear mine every day too. Hard hard for the win. Might. Dad, might wear this one on stage. It? We'll see. This might be my new stripes. Who? All right, let's vote. Who thinks Lacey should wear only car hearts on stage from now on? I don't like thinking about what I'm going to wear. You know, it's like, it seems like a basic human, you know, necessity to just, just everybody figures out what they're going to wear in the morning. And I'm just like, this is too stressful. I don't want to get out of bed. That, is that, that's dramatic, isn't it? Can you guys even hear what I'm saying? I know it's loud in here. <laughs> oh yeah, these are Carhartts, and they are so comfortable. Oh. We should tag Carhartt. Yeah, here, get out. I'm gonna take out. I'm gonna have to show you. No, you're gonna yes, you get out. You pulled over so out. So here's my Einstein socks. Einstein also wore the same clothes every day. He had one outfit. Josh got this for you. Gosh, got this for what? Is, what the, why are we here? It's a, it's a new stage outfit, everybody. What? It's your new stage outfit. So stage why outfit. did we Rock stop out. in front of this place? Oh, we're off. You know, mom, look at <laughs> the light. Dad, mom, light. look in front there's of you. Light. Look. That was look. awesome. Yeah. I got some. Well, oh, wow. there's one right here. Now, it's very windy today. No. And that was awesome. It ah, felt very nice. Our, our weather here is in Pennsylvania is great. It's the weirdest thing. Okay. That is a weird baby head. What the heck is that? What the heck is so, that? So, laundry house. Uh, we're not talking about anything still. I don't even know how to title this. This just, just live sing stream. Just a song. You guys, give me some titles for this live stream because I don't know Mom. what we're doing. Just sing a song. Oh, okay. Love is the only number that you'll ever see. Love is the loneliest only number that you'll. Love is a number. What? Love is what number is it? It's it's it's, it's, pi, it's eternal. It's eternity. Pi. It's 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 three point one four. Pi three point one four. It's a classical conversation song. Could you turn it off? The pi? area of a circle is pi three point one four. Is that right? Yeah. Times the radius squared. <laughs> okay, sorry. What's a radius? All right, so yeah, <laughs> so we have merchandise available. Um, we're gonna post it on Instagram pretty soon, Trevor. Trevor Talks is going to post it on there for us. Speaking of Trevor, make sure you follow his podcast, uh, Trevor Talks, as well as his uh, um, new social media store. I'm sorry, his new social media um, company. If you or you need someone, know someone who needs social media help, Transparent Media for the win. Uh, that's my plug for Trevor, who I love dearly. And um, yeah, over on LaceyStorm.com, we have. Uh, three new designs, and we brought back the Decree hoodie. Um, I'm already seeing the stock is low on some of them. But don't worry, if we run out, we're going to order more this time. Uh, what else? Let me think here. Um, we teamed up with somebody for merch, and I don't remember if he's been on this call. His name's Joseph Rubino. So, Joseph is our manager's son-in-law. Jordan is the one who did a lot of the illustrations for Lacey's books. Jordan Clark was her name. European merch. She did all the illustrations for the reason. Um, and a lot of the Lacey stuff, the old t-shirts, which is super cool. So her husband has a company, merch company called Contrast Merch, that we just started working with. And I love Joseph dearly. So the reason I'm mentioning him is number one to give a shout out. Thank you, Joseph. Thank you, Joseph. For the awesome merch, but also, um, Somebody had an issue with their order, and Joseph contacted them. They said, I don't know who you are, but you're not Lacey, so I'm not responding to this. Um, he is, in fact, on Team Lacey, so if anybody yeah. has an issue with uh, you know, merchandise and you hear from Joseph, 
over to Contrast Media. He's one of us guys. Okay? Love you, Joseph. Also, I saw some really funny bootleg merch out there. What, what was Lacey Stern for president? No, there was one. I don't know. I don't know, but bootleg merch is so weird. There's a lot of merch out there that we didn't make that has our my name on it and uh, our artwork. But anyway, yeah, with Joseph, that's real. That's from us. So if you want to support what we do, you should probably buy from that store if you want to. What's LazyStorm.com? That's our web store. LazyStorm.com? Yeah. Um, they also sell merch apparently on like Spotify. It is our merch. I don't know how they got it, but it's legit. I tried to shut them down. They're like, this is actually your stuff. And I'm like, okay, sorry. So oh, it said, there was a shirt out there that said, I don't need therapy. I listen to Lacey Sturm or something like that. It was something really funny. I'm like, what the heck is wrong? This is, some somebody made this shirt. I don't know. Anyway. If you're on the live chat and you made that. That's kind of funny, but it's also illegal. And uh, you should probably not sell bootleg merch. Well, maybe it's not illegal. They're not acting like it's from me, right? I really don't know. I do remember this happening at the cor at a corn show. We went outside. We walked outside somehow. I was in a hoodie and I was all like incognito and walked outside the concert. And there was like five vendors selling bootleg merch. And I was with the security guard from corn and he just started taking shirts. <laughs> <laughs> they just started taking shirts and they're like, hey, hey, you can't steal that. And he's like, what, what? And he showed him, he showed him his pants. He's like, you're not supposed to be selling these. And he started taking them. I was like, ooh, scary. Yeah, anyway, that, that happens even online, which is crazy. Speaking so blatant. Of, speaking of corn, are you guys digging the Love and Death cover with Brian Head Welch? Yeah. Let me love you. Let me love you. DJ Snake featuring Justin Bieber. Featuring Brian Head Welch featuring Lacey Sturm. It's a great tune. Let me love you. Yeah, that was fun. Okay. Um, okay. So bye, Mrs. Quidward39. Sorry you can't stay. Uh, we'll I don't know. Let's answer a few questions and then we gotta jump. Okay, Start questions. Is there any questions? We have five minutes. Five minute question. Questions. You've been listening to it every day. Awesome. I see bliss. Mom, it's a bliss. They like it. May God be glorified. Yes. Acoustic cover of Let Me Love You. Acoustic. Hmm, that's an interesting thought. What's your favorite female fronted band? Okay, let's see, my very favorite, first favorite female fronted band. Hole. I was gonna think, I was thinking of Hole, but actually it wasn't, it was garbage. Ooh. Maybe it was garbage. Which are two horrible names. Garbage Hole. It's terrible. <laughs> so sexist and feminine, like anti-feminine. It's terrible. Yeah. So those two. <laughs> Keep going. Quick questions. Come on. Okay, wait. Rapid sorry. Fire. When will new? Okay. Any other? Any plans for another book? Actually, I wish I could write a book. You know, I um. I feel like I need to. I need to give birth. <laughs> there's there's something that needs to to be removed from my brain and put on paper. But I don't know if it will happen. I have three children and trying to get along with my husband. <laughs> so who knows? Your personal favorite song off Memento of Mori? Let's see, what are those songs on there? I don't know. I like The Kind. Is that on Memento Mori? Treasure. Treasure. That's our song. That's so sweet. My favorite was Chasm. Chasm. Yes, that's a good one. Green, green God. Small green God. No, it's the name of it. What is it called? Your personal favorite song. Okay. When's the album dropping? There is rumors of it happening in May sometime. Next question. Okay, sorry. Don't talk about it too much. Doing more Lacey edits next. Okay. New album. Working on that. 
uh, talking about that. European merch store ever. I don't know. You guys can you guys can buy merch on our store. No. We ship to Europe. No. Yes, we do. He's telling. He told like 15 times why he can't buy it. Okay. I don't know. I'll have to look back through here, and I'll have our merch guy reach out. Yeah. Sorry about that. Good idea. Good as far question. As I know. Another book. Do you still keep in contact with your old bandmates? They're busy people with children. Not all of them, but a couple of them. And so, not always, but, and we live in different states. Texas and Pennsylvania are about 25 hours away from each other. So, not always, but sometimes. Um, can you sing a song? <laughs> I probably could. Um, Will you ever do another concert while you're pregnant? Big question. How can I predict that kind yes. of thing? I can't be. Did you say something about moving to Tulsa? <laughs> yeah. I did talk about that. Uh, no question, just you're my favorite female friend of band. Oh. Well, thanks. I didn't forget you, 38. Your question, your question was not a question. Actually, you stayed to me on the drum. So fun to play. Awesome. I love that. It's a new single anytime soon. Love the messages in your two singles, by the way. Awesome. Thanks for listening to the messages. I love you and Evanescence. Cool. I wrote with a guy who helped write with Evanescence. And he was a really cool dude. Um, for live streams albums. Uh, is there going to be another collaboration with Breaking Benjamin? You never know. No, I don't know. Any date on when the new album is coming out. Listen, all these questions are, I don't know how to answer these questions. previous response. Because Hopefully I can't predict the future. It's supposed to be May. Sometimes I can, but. Don't hold us to it. It's supposed to be May. Next most question. of the time, I'm just here now, present. Ask me a present question. Favorite song right now to jam to. The one my song, my son is singing. I don't know what it is, but. No, Alex. Anyway, something my kids are singing. Okay. What would you say to a new Christian? Um, Hi. Welcome to the family! Woo! We're gonna be together forever. Plans to worship for a worship album? No. Um, everything's worship if you just, you know, it's all, it's all that. Yeah. Right? Life is worship. To live is to worship. What are you worshiping? That's the question. Next question. We're running out of time. Okay. Plans for. You could self-publish on Amazon. How old are the boys now? Okay, how old are you, Atticus? Atticus, how old are you? Me too. How old are you, Arrow? Seven. How old are you? Eleventeen. Wow, we've been eleventeen or already. Eleventeen, that's a good age. My question is, what's your advice for pro promoting my music? I think you just do what you love and really, really... Um, what do you have? Do you have advice for this? Um, write it, write it on you like <laughs> that really works well for us, doesn't it? Sometimes it gets on your nerves. That's how I am. I do it by not doing it. That's my thing. And Josh is like, get away from the merch table, quit giving stuff away. Okay, I don't know. I'm sorry, I'm not good at marketing. Um, but I just, just, but, I, but I, my advice would be to just love what you do and write an album you would want to listen to. That's it. And uh, if other people want to, cool. If they don't, I wouldn't let myself so that stop me from creating. Have you ever heard Icon for Hours new album? No, I did not. I don't know. I don't think so. Uh, yeah, I love. Um, let's see. You going to do any more dog tag necklaces? Okay. Good idea. Thanks for the idea. What's your name? All right, we're gonna do dog Dovey tags. Mama. It'll be your. We're we're getting get low away. stock alerts, guys. Okay, I'm sorry. Green Heart. It's off New Horizons. Thanks. Thanks. All right. 15 seconds. Okay, 15 seconds. Need right, uh, albums on vinyl. Double Jeopardy. Yeah, we were supposed to do live screens with Come vinyl. I don't know what happened, but I would like a vinyl as well. Two more questions. <laughs> Courtney Love is class. She's well underrated because of your, of her behavior. Joan Jett is legit too. Well, what Courtney Love taught me before as a teenager was similar to what Kurt Cobain taught was that you can just emotionally vomit things and it doesn't have to sound good to f feel right. <laughs> Courtney Love's a great actor, by the way. You know, just like 
just sing that. And if you mean it, uh, yeah, I don't know. Controversial topic there with Courtney Love, so we'll just move on. All right. Fleetwood Mac, be considered a female friend of Bates. Fleetwood Mac. Uh, who would you do a duet with? I don't know. Um, that'd be cool to meet Steven Tyler one day, maybe. Are you wanting another kid? Listen, I want all the kids in the world, okay? If you have a kid, you don't want your kid, just call me. I want the chil I want all the children. I want to have a house big enough for everybody. I love the all the orphans in the world. So, I don't... Alright, one last question. Skincare secrets. Um, thanks, Maggie. Sevenfold. Um, last question. You know, I don't know. Skincare secrets? I have... Oh, well, I can tell you. You know what my favorite memes are right now? <laughs> My favorite memes are the um, the ones about the women seven seven different shampoo products cost like two hundred dollars yeah. for for very mediocre hair. Men use foot wash from the dollar store <laughs> and it shows like this line with That's... this beautiful mane or whatever. It's so true. You know, guys can use a bar of soap and they come. I've been using Josh's tea tree. It's by anchor Duke anchor Cannon. anchor man. Hair anchor, anchor. What is it? Uh, News anchor hair, tea tree oil, whatever. I do can. And listen, I use that. That's what all I. That's all I use on my face, everywhere. Really? <laughs> no, I do actually. I use Young Living. Um, some Young Living products. I my skin. I'm actually getting over allergic reaction to the bleach, which I have identified because I always don't know. I've had this allergic reaction here like on my face it gets real itchy and red and patch like patches of whelps and stuff <laughs> and I think it's the bleach uh, my friend works at a salon and she she's well she's she owns a salon and um she does this the bleach on my hair and I think I'm reacting to it so I haven't done anything really with my skin All right, one last question okay this sorry one, that was this, a long no, this one's for you long for answer now. This last cares? question is for you guys. Okay, sorry, it's been longer than 15 seconds, babe. Okay, Lacey's... Dear Agony, Aurora was beautiful. Lacey Let's wants to dye it. her hair. She wants to do it blue. I said she should do it lavender. They don't get to take, say what I do with my hair. All right. <laughs> sorry, I don't care what you think about my hair. Just kidding. Just kidding. I'm sorry. I really am. I'm going to be very rude, aren't I? Oh, man. Not the bleach. Me too. Okay, yeah. Gotta go. We love you guys. You're Okay. I'm gonna push the end button. Wanda Vision or Winter Soldier? What is uh, that? I mean? haven't seen either, but I'm really excited to watch That's both. for lunch. Well, well lunch. I just Arby's had fish sandwich. Arby's Lent. Arby's fish sandwich. Any other sandwich. Lent, Lent people out there? Pesky tea and. Could you stop right here, Dad? Oh man, not the bleach. Me too. Okay, wait. Singer right tutorials. Ooh, we should Can do singer favorite? tutorials. As you guys run down the. Okay. Mean skincare. Yeah, Josh is better about skincare stuff. What else did you have? We have there. I'm not gonna tell him. I'm not gonna tell him your secrets. You can tell him my secrets. I don't care. See how beautiful Josh's Here skin you is. Go. Here you go, Daddy. Here. You take me out, Daddy. <laughs> you take me out, Daddy. He's like, take me out, Daddy. We're in the driveway. Do not be afraid of our parenting issues. Okay. I got it. Okay. Well. I got it. Thank you guys for hanging out. We're going to get off here. Don't. Thank you guys. <laughs> no, we're I'm not. not. I'm sorry. Okay. We're hey, pretty... listen, if merch runs out, we're going to probably order more. So, love you guys. Hope you like the merch. Hope you like the song. Gotta go. Bye.